<laughs> Great start. Tiger attack! <laughs> okay, yeah. That was... Uh... <laughs> that was ordered into participation by a tiger. Okay, right, let's try that again, shall we? Hello everyone and welcome to yet another special Feral's Blind React yeah, thing, yeah. Hey everybody, welcome to another special Feral's Blind Reactions. Special today because um, I've managed to get my hands on the ones that I've the, the one that I've not done up until yet, which I've intended to, which is Escape from Katrina. And I think I may have found the whole thing with the missing song, so we'll have to see how it goes. Let's hope, fingers crossed on that one. Before I get started, I do just need to say, um, the, uh, the, the, the folk who donated the headbands and the, the, the accessories to the channel last time, I am obliged to hate them just a little bit, and I'm sorry about that, but uh, as they have said they didn't know at the time, two of them were glittery. And it's now been over a week, and I'm still finding glitter everywhere. It's like the confetti. It's just, once it's there, you can't get rid of it. <sighs> oh, well. Let's go and watch this thing, shall we? Let's go the clicky click and watch the thingy thing. Click click. And eventually it starts. Okay, that's another great start, isn't it? The thing isn't starting. One eternity later. Hey, there we go. Second time's a charm. Ooh, okay, um... Right, okay, this appears to be a straight from VHS rip. Um, you know what? I am actually gonna risk it. If that doesn't become a, uh, standard throughout the whole thing, I'll, I'll risk it. Apparently, ponies exhale helium. Whoops. You did it all right, Sundance. You ruined our song. All right, chill out. You can make another one. I only tried to get the ball. Come on, it was oh, an accident. No. Leave off. Um, Can't splash me. Wow, you've got one hell of a kick if that is enough to. Okay, um, apparently someone can't, can't swim. Well, the sea ponies will see that you get help. Oh, good. Spike is still there and unlucky. Hmm, this is looking a bit familiar. Oh, gone, Posey. Oh, poor thing. More confetti. Okay, so that cave leads to a whole underground kingdom that they didn't know about. Where apparently bushwoolies are doing a thing. Oh boy. Okay. Take it to Katrina. And whatever you do, don't spill it. Wow, so all of that made a few drops of thing. I'm presuming catnip. Yes, I did already know what Katrina Here's your witch she weed purrs. A oh, witch weed, okay. Okay. You fur brain! You spilled my precious potion. Um. Right, okay, so she's basically an addict then. We're going to escape! Yeah, escape! Escape! Okay. Did you say escape? Don't drop no, me! No, please please don't drop me! Yeah, please don't drop him. Couldn't they just lose a privilege? Um, what privileges can they have? You have no privileges, you're my slave! Exactly! 
Okay, so... Yeah, there we go. Right, so he's the not entirely bad guy then. How dare you betray me? Ah. Bring me your witch weed potion. She's really not so bad once you get to know her better. Yeah, she's basically jonesing then. We blow up balloon Sundance? No, but you can give me that string over there. Okay. Wrong one! Wrong one! Oh boy! Um, oh, yeah, uh... <laughs> Sorry. You're so close. Why just changed colour? He was orange and... So what, is the orange paint as well? I don't know what's going on here. Okay, so the balloon's released at just the right time, apparently. As our guest of honour, we want you to wear this. The rainbow of light. <laughs> yes. This hugely magical item that we've just been sort of hanging I'm around baby with. Moon I'm baby surprise. I'm baby glory. I'm baby kind candy. Oh, lots of babies. You need your rest. But we don't that, want a rest. So that's the nursery then. Into the, it's the nursery old nursery. You go, yeah. And no more complaints. That's kind of adorable. I'll take care of them, Posey. Why did she wink then? I'll take care of them, Posey. Be a locomotive and caboose. Okay, how are they even standing like that anyway? That's that's some sort of magical blocks there. <laughs> Imagine it, magical blocks in a magical nursery in a magical world full of magical talking ponies. Let's stay up until dawn. <laughs> that's not a good idea if you're not a child. Goodness me, did someone yawn? Yeah, okay, that's kind of adorable. Feel my heart melting. Where's my teddy? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna need to do something manly after this. I am going to need to do something very manly after, because that's just so squee adorable. Okay, proof that everything is cute when it's asleep, even Katrina. Asking for trouble. Time to escape. Yeah, do you really think she's not going to have some sort of safeguard in place when she's Let asleep? Let me talk to Katrina. Maybe I can get you shorter hours. Shorter hours, yeah! Um, too late. Too late. Yeah, shorter hours. I don't think that's going to do slave labour much good. A window so you can see out! Yeah, a window! Wow, these guys are easily led. Oh dear. Do you hear anything? No, neither do I. The bush will exactly. easily stop working. Actually, Katrina, that's not exactly true. And they're no, still no. working? Well... No, no, it is true. They've stopped working and run away. How could they escape? You were guarding them. <laughs> it's not really guarding if you have no imprisonment measures. It didn't even have any bars over the exit. <laughs> Too fast. We can't catch them. What am I going to do? Well, ha hasn't she been using magic? I mean, isn't she a sorceress? Could she just magic them? You've grown so cold. That's it. Cold. I'll make a snowstorm. So did she not used to be like this? <laughs> did she actually used to be a good person, but then... Got addicted to the witch weed and uh, kind of became this. That's enough, Katrina. Could she just not have used magic to uh, capture the bush woolies? Here, get Megan in the rainbow of light. That rainbow, it's a solution to and the cause of all life's problems. Help! Help! We can't move! Well, don't worry, in a few minutes, hypothermia will set in and you'll just. Go to sleep. Forever. Hey, Rainbow. Do your stuff. Oh, it is. No, for a second there, I was worried it wasn't in there. Good work, Rainbow. I guess we'll have to find some other slaves. Nope. I want those little ponies. Yeah, keep going on about slaves. Nowadays, you, you definitely not get away with that. 
There'd be servants or minions or something, just not slaves. Why wouldn't I want the potion? It makes me powerful! He seems to really like care for who she wants powerful. to be. I like oh. being powerful! We used to have fun together. We'd laugh and play. What happened wow, to okay, yeah. Thing? There used to be a time, or maybe you've forgotten, when you weren't lean and rotten. Yeah, that's right. C call her mean and rotten while she's still jonesing, while she's still desperate for a fix. I've heard enough. I like to play rough, and if you don't, it's tough. Oh. <laughs> okay, so her actions are changing the photographs then. That just floated off. That reached that hill. <laughs> that 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 turned to a downhill and just kept on going. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm choosing to believe magic rather than animation error. And the sweet pussy cat I knew. Pussy cat. Oh uh, yes. Okay, so I was right. She used to be sweet and nice, and then she encountered the uh, witchweed potion. Now look what you've done. I'm out of witchweed potion. <laughs> oh, please, never, ever, ever do that again. Dreamcast is so beautiful. All that's left to do is hang these balloons. I'll help. Hang on. No thanks, Sundance. So that random sudden snowstorm nearly buried and, and or killed them. They saw a giant snowball starting to take several of them away, and now the... Oh, what did I miss? Right, okay, so they're being mean at her for being clumsy. Right, okay, but no, no, they've just been through all that, and now they're not even a little bit suspicious that something might be going on. Now if I wanted that big, juicy apple... I can't reach it. I can. Okay, that was quite a jump. And you didn't crash or anything. Maybe I was just lucky. You're not lucky. You're special. Thing. Special. Special. My turn now. Oh, I want to see. Come on, baby pony. Oh, that just too adorable. I can feel a little bit of manliness I had left just eroding. So where's your costume? Don't have one. Why not? Don't have anything to wear. Oh no! No, 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 you can always do something with something. How's that? Pretty. Yeah, that'll do the job. Gee, the rainbow locket. What? The most magical, magical, amazing, incredible artifact. <laughs> in the universe, the pony universe, and they're just... He's a shapeshifter. They're just letting a child walk around with it. What a pretty locket. Can I see it? Why? Uh, I'm a nurse. I have to examine it. I'm not sure that follows. Every now, okay, he's not being particularly nice now either. And Katrina. What, she's just casually wandering off now. This this must be some sort of regular occurrence though. Ah! Running and ah! screaming about stranger danger until then. Okay, yeah, don't insult the girl when she's uh, already cranky. Okay, so yeah, another kidnapping, another capture. The the, the main thing that the so that the pony seems to be good at is getting captured. Still, you aren't looking for a large cat by any chance, are you? <laughs> Those dang furries. We've got to get down there and save Baby Moon Dancer and the Rainbow of Light. Follow me. I gotta be honest. Everyone in the fandom always says, you know, oh, if you could, if you found a portal, would you go to the Pony World? And I'm gonna be honest. If this is it, I don't think I would. Will you be my slaves? No. Okay. Let's say goodbye to baby what? Mother. No. Don't. Don't do it. Wait. That's going too far. 
Jeez, she was actually going to drop her in there. But yeah, no, if it just means constant risk of slavery and abduction and general death, then no, I wouldn't want to go there. Woo! You actually tried to jump it! It was safe to go around, and you actually tried to jump it! Alfred! Help me! Now, I don't know, Katrina. If only you could change and be good again! I can change! It's, it's amazing how a near-death experience can change a person. Now he's turning evil! If you destroy the Witchwing machine! But that took forever to build! Can't you think of something else? Wait! I'll do it! I need some more potion. I'm, I'm out of power. Oh, don't do it. You can save her other ways. Here it comes, Katrina. <laughs> Katrina. Remember what you said. Uh -huh. What? She's actually done it. Okay. Okay. She, she kind of changed sides pretty quickly. <laughs> And Spike is once again the comic relief, as he always will be forever. Because <laughs> it wouldn't be the same without it. So, all these things must have been concepts already, or did Megan bring the concept of cheerleaders over with her? So now they're talking about how it's great when you can occasionally not be yourself sometimes. I've got to admit that I'm, I can kind of be on board with that. Come on, Katrina. Your public awaits. I'd be happy to admit that you're standing on my dress. <laughs> Hang on, was she already wearing the locket on the walk up to there? No. It looked like she was. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Right. Okay. So it seems like the uh, VHS glitches held off until it was uh, until it reached the end here. Right. Okay. So she's leaving presumably back to the human world in this one. So she's left back to the human world, so it must be during the series only that she sort of goes to live there. Well, that didn't seem quite as dark as uh, Rescue at Midnight Castle, but it was still kind of... You know, it, it was it had its dark moments. Give me what I want or I'll drown this baby was uh, one that springs to mind. The other is, hey, look, you've started an uprising. Let's drop you into this pit and drown you. But yeah, aside from the attempted slavery and the uh, once again near genocide and attempted kidnap, it wasn't as dark as it could have been. But Katrina kind of turned a bit quick there, didn't she? I know that it was once again a case of, well, they kind of had to fit the whole thing into 22 minutes. But it sort of suffered from the, hey, here is character, she is bad, but now good. I know, I know what you want in 22 minutes for a cartoon made for kids. A little bit of development. You know, a little bit of conflict before destroying the uh, witchweed machine. Which, yeah, by the way... Analogy for drug addiction. Gotta be that. It's kind of, kind of gotta be that. I've really got to stop looking away from the camera when I stop talking. It makes editing very difficult and my editor shouts at me and hurts me. But yeah, once again, it seems a case of that the ponies can't be kind unless there is something forcing them to. Okay, yeah, Sundancer had a few accidents, but there was no need to sort of push her out. Yeah, okay, tell someone that you're kind of not helping as much as you could be, but to then be mean to them to the point that they wander off 
crying, that's that's a little unnecessary. But I suppose it all worked out in the end. Oh, hang on. Yeah, she saved the baby and no one apologised to her. It was it was great. Yeah, I've saved the baby pony. That's great. Thank you. Oh, by the way, yeah. Sorry we were mean. That wouldn't have gone amiss. Yeah? Just, just another point of evidence there. Ponies is cruel. Unless there is something forcing them not to be. Anyway, yes, that was fun. It was a little bit dark. Not as dark as it could have been, as I've said. And it was either a case... Of, it felt like either there was a case of too much going on for it to fit in, and so they kind of had to shorten a few processes, such as Katrina's conversion to good, or there was just not as much going on as there could have. It's kind of 50-50. But anyway, I still enjoyed it, and I'm, I'm really having fun getting back to Gen 1, and I cannot wait to see more. I hope you will join me next time when I watch some more of a similar thing when I carry on with My Little Pony and Friends. See you next time, everybody.